happening today. Chicago's oldest dog party kicks off today at Soldier Field. You may remember the event as Bark in the Park. Now it's just Bark. It includes a dog friendly marketplace, demonstrations, agility courses, and so much more. Thousands of dogs and their owners are expected to attend the event today. The Anti Cruelty Society puts on Bark, and our own Roz Barron and Jose Sanders are today's MCs. We see Roz out there right now, and there's Hey! Oh, it's great to see you, too. Us. What a great assignment you all have, and two dog lovers, right? Absolutely. We are both big dog oh, lovers. Oh, fanatics, <laughs> Sam. Fanatics. <laughs> and we've got our dogs here, and we have the people who help put this together. Aaron, you are in charge of special events, and Tracy, the CEO president Good of Anti-Cruelty. Good morning. So, Jose, why don't you talk to Tracy a little bit about this event? Hey, this is a wonderful thing, something we look forward to every year. We call it a, a reunion, a doggy picnic. Absolutely. <laughs> the biggest dog party in Chicago. Absolutely. So, it's really a benefit as well, right? It is, yes. We're hoping to raise $250,000. We're at about two hundred and five right now. And uh, it all goes towards making sure that we find new homes for homeless dogs, care for animals in the community, and do our work at the anti cruelty, which we've been doing for 124 years. Indeed. Tell me how important this is to anti cruelty. Well, it's very important. The money is, of course, important. But what's also important is getting people out here and enjoying themselves with their dogs, seeing the kind of work that we do, getting people involved in our work. And anybody can come out and do this. This is not something you have to uh, dress up for or schedule on a right, Saturday right. night. You can come here and have fun with dogs, whether you have one or not. Speaking of fun, Ross, it is oh, so much fun, right? It, it, this is, I mean, we have perfect weather for this, so uh -huh. we got super, super lucky. Come here, come Big here, come here, come here. Uh -oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's the one thing you really have to do, so keep them on a leash. I want to talk to Aaron Daly about putting this together. How much work is this and, and uh, labor of love? It is. I mean, months and months of preparation with getting vendors and sponsors committed, inviting people to the event, getting their dogs to come, but it is all in culmination on this beautiful day. We have tons of activities, lots of food and drink, so lots of opportunities for people to come and enjoy the morning with their dog. Talk about some of the specific activities going on here in some of the tents and things that we can enjoy. Yeah, so we have our canine carnival over here, so we've got lots of games where dogs can win prizes and so can humans. We have crafty critters where they can make a special art piece to take home. We also have our VIP area, which is exclusive for our big fundraisers who raise $500 or more. So we have an open play place where the dogs can go off leash. They can get a personal portrait of their pet and they can also get Portillo's lunch. And then we're in the middle of our marketplace, so we have over 30 different pet-friendly vendors that have different items and pet-friendly uh, options for people to buy and take home. That's, that's really awesome. I mean, that, that's a lot of stuff going on yeah. here. Um, Tracy, I wanted to ask you, how long has anti-cruelty been around? Well, we've been around for 124 years. On March 9th of 2024, we will be 125 years old. Amazing. One of the oldest uh, uh, animal welfare organizations in the country. And we are starting this entire year uh, of celebrating that 125 years. And uh, this is just one of those aspects of our celebration. This is, what, the 30th bark this year? 29th. 29. 29. 29. Yes. On our 125th year, we will actually have the 30th bark next year as well. Awesome. I've got hey. Milo sitting on say, my mic. Say, yeah, <laughs> Milo, this is Milo. He came from anti cruelty. He's my little poot. He's a, a dachshund and pat, 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 uh, Palm and Cha Cha, all together, everything. That's a big <laughs> blend. A okay, this is Lola. And She's a whippet. Cool. That's cool. And my other whippet is over there with that's my cool. husband. But I can't, cool. I can't cool. have all that's these dogs cool. at the same time. But I think we need to wrap because we need to get this party started. Bye. So back yeah. to you guys. Good boy. Oh, and Mark good boy. and Samantha. Absolutely. I love to see it. I knew Lola would be out there, Roz. I just knew it. So that's fantastic. <laughs> yeah. I can't wait. You guys have the best time out there. We've got the details yes. about today's event. It's from 8 this morning until 1 this afternoon over at Soldier Field. Admission is $50 for adults, $10 for kids, and it is open to the public. That's right. More information on our website, abc7chicago.com. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.